right, so three days ago I took off the IDEX off of my Rat Rig 400 VCore 4 um, to test out. So this was one of the IDEX models, and you can kind of see how there's gaps, like just they're offset on one side, but this side they're perfectly flush. It happened on the inside, like the distance the problems, the alignment was like perfect. And if you try to mix in the material, it would intermix with each other. So this is the one issue. Um, this is one of the only fit passable prints I actually got off of it. And it's a laundry list of errors. Um, this took 38 minutes to print um, on a fast machine. My Voron, for reference, does this in 27. Um, so that's pretty much more or less stock settings for me. And so the fact that this took longer than my Voron was kind of a concern. Um, should be, I mean, the speeds, they say 10K, I was running at like three and a half, maybe four at certain times, at, you know, not 600 millimeters a second, more like 270, it just, it just, it wasn't great, right? So fast forward three days, this Benji, 22 minutes now, it is, for lack of a better word, perfect, um, running at 25,000 K acceleration on the X and 12,000 on the Y, and this was just standard settings, 22 minutes, not much more changing to that. And as you can see, this is the change. So I have converted it back to a single tool head and it is printing flawless. So yeah, like even for Slayer, right? Cannot see the text at all, period. Clear as day, right? So there's definitely something with the IDEX. I'm not gonna give up on it but it doesn't work the way I want it to, which sucks. So it has been removed. Uh, the fat rig needs to actually make me money to pay back itself. So it is going into production mode here. I'm just doing some pet G printing, testing, and a Benji in 35 minutes in pet G. Um, and it looks pretty good. I'll have another video in the future here. I'll even show you a video before this is done of it actually printing. Um, but yes, so rat rig has been converted to single working better and you know what I actually kind of like it I might even try to get his hands on the turtle box from LVO and mock it up in there and we'll be able to do some kind of multicoloring printing might be the best option for it um, we'll have to see I need to get a hold of Jason see if I can get one and then we will try to have some fun with that and um, I here's a video of the rat rig printing pet G at really fast speeds and corrected, it's actually 38 minutes, not 35, I'm sorry. But in any case, you can see the speeds are relatively high. It's doing pretty good. And this is it printing a Benchy. Now there seems to be a little bit of over extrusion, which I will deal with here. Um, I just kind of guessed. And then I might need to change the fan settings a little bit. But um, overall, it's printing really, really nicely for uh, you know having that issue I had before.